man. So today I got this article I want to read for y'all and it is titled, A Kobe White Could Possibly Win Most Improved Player of the Year Award. And the reason why I was prompted to do this video because you know, if you guys watch Chicago Bulls media day, Kobe White said that he expects himself to take a jump. And Billy Donovan also said Kobe White should take a jump this year. And you know, it makes all sense. If you look at guys like Luka Doncic and Trey Young, their year twos compared to their year ones, it's just night and day. These young guys, it's becoming common for these guys to take jumps in their second years. And I fully believe that Kobe White could take a second jump. So let's read this article. It says, even the wise guys are getting wise to Kobe White. What kind of quote is that? that sounds like some Star Wars, Qui-Gon Jinn, whatever. Let's continue to read the article. It says, the kid may be about to prove it. Slowing down, White said earlier this week about continuing comfort in the NBA. Last year, I played at one speed a lot, especially in the half court. Slowing the game down a little bit, making decisions off ball screens, and just making the simple play, not making it harder than what it needs to be. I feel like I'll play a long time in this league. Knock on wood, you know, no injuries or nothing like that. If I continue to get better, I'll play a long time in this league and hopefully get a championship and get some wins while I'm here. Okay, so I'm gonna sum up the rest of the article for you guys. So they basically ended up talking about how, you know, the Bulls, you know, a lot of disadvantage that other teams have is that they were recently in the NBA bubble, they were in the playoffs, okay? They, they haven't had the proper time to rest. And basically the article made a point to say that Kobe White has had extra time to rest than other players who could possibly win most improved player of the year awards. So the 16 teams, those players in the, on those 16 teams automatically have a disadvantage compared to Kobe White. And then they compare Kobe White to the rest of the teams who weren't in the bubble. And they said that basically out of all the players that they looked at, Kobe White has the best shot to have, to have a, a year two jump and win most improved player of the year award. I'm right behind him, you know, I'm looking at guys like Sekou, I'm looking at guys like Kobe White, I'm looking at a Mitchell Robinson out of New York. You know, there are so many guys who you could just look at and say, who's gonna take the year two jump and why not be Kobe White? Kobe White has trained his butt off just as much as any other player in the NBA. Why not him? He's the prototypical point guard. He's a talented passer, a good shooter, great handle, and plays defense as well. Why not be Kobe White? Why, why can't it be Kobe White? And this new Billy Donovan system, you know, I heard the players talking about how energized they are, how much they just feel better about being in this system, not being in the dark cloud that, that was Jim Boylan. They just feel so much better. They're more energized. It's just so much more positivity coming into this year. Picking up a rookie like Patrick Williams and Devon Dawson, you know, Laurie Markkinen is healthy now. Wendell is healthy. You know, this, this team right now, it's so much positivity going towards this team. Why not Kobe White? take a jump as well with the team. I fully believe that this year, Kobe White will take a jump. And I'm willing to put my money on it. So yeah, guys, that's that's basically all that I have to say in this video. Like this video, comment on this video, share this video. Thank y'all for 1K. I'm out.